Well, this is kind of ground zero, I guess, for all asphalt and, and concrete and that kind of stuff because that is, sand is a huge ingredient in that. Today we're at uh, our Harvey pit. Basically, we're dredging out sand to uh, a depth of about 65 feet here. We tried different ways to get material out of the, you know, deeper and, and get the material out. None of them worked. We tried a drag line. We've tried long, long uh, reach shovels. Still couldn't get as much as we wanted. The dredge allows us to, to extract all the sand we can get. What's on it is a, they call it a ladder. It basically, it lowers itself down and it's got like a big cutter head on it. It's basically like a giant shop vac. Just sucks the sand. Any stones smaller than eight inches uh, go through it. It's more efficient, we believe, than a, a drag line or a shovel because you can get down deeper and get more material for us. We're getting around 300 ton an hour, so we're doing not too bad. Once we dredge it, we put it in settling ponds. And once the water settles out of it, we load it and bring it to the processing plant. Well, this is uh, the Hal Ross sand pit uh, for R.W. Thomason. Uh, it's a wash plant. This is where we process the material and we feed it into the hoppers. And from there, we blend in different types of material, whether it be coarser feed and finer feed. If you ever hold up a handful of sand and you look at it, you'll realize actually there's many different grains in it. So what we try and do here is try and, uh, you gotta have so many grains in your sand, so you just try and monitor that. We send it to our screener where it gets sized, and from there the sized material goes into the classifier. The classifier helps us make an end product that's always consistent. It comes down to about a one inch stone, and anything passing from there will go through the wash deck and into our crushers, and then it, the crushers will make it down to a 5 16th size, and that'll uh, end out in our final product as concrete or asphalt sand. It's just fascinating to see the sand transform into a finished product, like concrete or asphalt or whatever they're using the sand for. Well, with the innovation, Tomlinson's always willing to try uh, new and better approaches, you know, try and get a little bit bigger and stronger and be able to go places and do stuff that a lot of other companies aren't able to do. We're never standing still, so, so that's what I like about coming to work here, is there's always something to look forward to and improvements we made and uh, change makes life interesting. It's a lot of fun. You're like a giant kid in a giant sandbox.